So okay. my next guest thinks that it's disturbing to see the U.S. flag desecrated, but he disagrees with the president-elect's suggestion. Joining me now, Jonathan Turley, professor at the George Washington University Law School. Professor, good to see you. I mean, Thanks, it's, man. none of us likes to see the, the flag burn. I mean, apparently some people do, but I think most reasonable people don't like to see that. Uh, but yet banning it says something else about us that would be far more disturbing. Well, it's a curious notion, isn't it? The flag represents our collective rights, and you hardly honor it by abridging those rights, which is what is being suggested. The First Amendment has never been amended. It has never been reduced. It has served us so well since the founding of this republic. Uh, and the suggestion that we should now amend the First Amendment because of what on average is about five to seven uh, flag burnings a year, I think is rather reckless. I mean, the question is, do you want the government in the business of criminalizing speech? Those people that want to allow Congress to do it have got to think about the implications of that. You know, many of the Trump supporters were very concerned about a Clinton administration. You shouldn't repeat the mistakes of the Democrats. You shouldn't, because you have power, just hand more power to this government like this is the last president you're ever going to see. We well, have didn't a duty. we just get through an election where Donald Trump was placed in office in part because he said we need to toughen up as a society, we've, got, we've become too politically correct, you should be allowed to offend, that's part of being an American. I mean, th this is part of that. It doesn't just apply to liberals or conservatives, it, pl it applies to everybody. Right, and you know, you saw the First Amendment in your clips. Hundreds of people came out with flags explaining to these students what they really mean. What that veteran said was very moving when he said they have a right to, to pull down the flag and I have a right to tell them why that's wrong and why that hurts. That's free right. speech. That's much more powerful than dragging people away and arresting them for burning a flag. Professor, great to see you. Thanks, Megan.